Hello everyone, welcome back to another video, and today we'll be talking about the new Nikkei D, which is an amazing addition to, uh, to our team. Uh, we have met D in chapter 14, in the middle of chapter 14. Uh, I'm not gonna give any spoilers for any of you who haven't gone past to that point yet, but we're just going to go ahead and take a look at our skills. And I took a brief look at it uh, firsthand, and I have to say it is absolutely amazing. Uh, so what the first skill does uh, Increases damage to strong element 46.93% for 15 seconds. So everything here lasts for 15 seconds and then uh, she Gains a ton of damage bonus as a strong element and then When the skill activates f for the first time in a battle It heals her by a whole bunch like 16.5 of attack damage. So she's all about the initiative. She's all about uh, getting the first strike, which is further, uh, which is further cemented in skill two. Activates when the target appears, affects all allies. Charge burst gauge by 98.56%. Activates one time per battle. So that is very, very close to 100%. So on skill 2, level 10, when you enter a battle, you can immediately go full burst. Which is absolutely, absolutely amazing and something that we've never seen before. The second effect is she becomes immune to stun for the first 30 or so seconds. And the third effect being in the first 15 seconds, she gains a huge damage boost as long as she is the strong attacking element. Now for the burst skill, the first is the classic AoE damage attacking all enemies, kind of like Scarlet. But the second and third effect is the spotlight. Affects all attacker allies. When attacking a certain part of an enemy, damage dealt to the part is increased by 42.38% for 15 seconds. So you're going to inflict a lot of damage to the enemies that has parts in it. And of course, the third one will increase the burst time, the full burst time, by 5 seconds. Now here's the thing, Modernia has a skill, uh, her full burst skill increases the full burst duration by 5 seconds. Now I don't know if you use D and Modernia on the same team, does the full burst time increase stack up? We've yet to find that out, but I believe that if we get her through these polls, we're just gonna go ahead and review that. Now with that out of the way, let's get to the polls. Honestly, she looks very very sick and I like her design and I'm very excited to get her. Let's go. Alright, first multi, let's see what we got. So we just slowly slide it here and what do we get? Ooh, apparently we got nothing. I mean, that's too pretty much to be expected for the first pulse, I believe. Yes. Now let's go ahead and move on to the second multi. I uh, I have a lot of gems saved up for Nihilister, but Nihilister turned out to be a turned out to be a liberation Nikkei. So we're just gonna go ahead and use these gems and see what we get. Bada bing, bada boom. Woohoo! That SSR animation always looks satisfying. Okay, yes, that's the last one. We're just gonna go ahead and skip to the last one. Let's see. Her manufacturer is Alicion. Let's see if we get an Alicion. I'm holding my breath and. Do you wish to wear the crown? Can you wear voila! The D has come! That sounded so wrong! Okay, first of all, I want to apologize. Because I was wrong about several things. The first thing being that both Modernia and the D are burst free Nikkei's. Therefore, their burst skills cannot activate at the same time. So the extension of the full burst time, well, obviously, it cannot stack. And secondly, in 
the D second skill in which it says the target appears it does not mean in the start of battle but when the target appears in a boss fight or in a destroy battle when the uh, main boss basically appears so it's not a star battle and well I was being stupid about that I'm very sorry but we're just gonna go ahead and demonstrate the D all right all right all right let's go ahead and take control of her actually I just I need to turn off that auto yeah I don't think she needs a coat remover uh that coat is doing a lot of a lot of work in the physics department <laughs> yeah I mean she's not attacking uh, she's not attacking a weakness element but when the target appears uh, the burst uh, the burst gauge immediately went to full so even though you use uh, even though in the middle of the stage you used up your uh, burst meter once and then when the target appears it's gonna go ahead and refill so you can go full burst again which is absolutely insane still even though it's not like at the start of battle all right that should be it for the first impression for D uh, should you pull her is she strong yes she is very strong and you should pull for her she will make a fine addition to your team especially when fighting bosses where she can just instantly fill up your burst gauge and then you can immediately immediately go full burst go immediately go to town on the boss so uh yeah that's all for today guys i hope you enjoyed like and subscribe if you want to see more and i'll see you next time Bye bye